Keith Moreland, Greg Swindell. Final game of the homestand, Sam Houston State comes to town. And Pete Hansen takes them out in the first inning. A little bit of jitters early. Zeke. Freshman out of California, yeah, gets a pop fly. He thinks it's second out of the inning, but Duke just cannot handle it. Then the base hit would load the bases. Right here, score a run, but Eric Kennedy's going to come up big. Throw out the runner home for the third out of the inning. Sam Houston will only get one run in that first. So he stayed that way, and Jack Rogers was really good. He limited the Longhorns with his fastball, had a good changeup. This is a guy that was a recruited as a two-way player, but this is the first time he's ever got the opportunity to pitch. Yeah, three innings in his career, pitched into the fifth tonight, but after that first inning, Pete Hansen turned it up a notch. He would not give up another hit through the next four innings. As a matter of fact, he would go four perfect into the fifth inning. And qualify himself for the victory if the Longhorns could take the lead in the fifth. And that's what happened. Eric Kennedy started it off. He got to the plate, got a base hit. He was the first of nine guys that would come to the plate. And the Longhorns just kept adding on. Nice base running here, going first to third with nobody out right there. Big part of that inning right there. Big part of the inning, getting safely, but then a double play that was not turned right here by Sam Houston. Eric Kennedy would come across, and then Austin Todd with a big two-out knock the other way, and then that brings Zuby to the plate. He drives in his 12th and 13th run of the year. Obviously, Bill, Texas has a four to one lead. Andre Duplantier back out there for the ninth inning. He'll get the strikeout, another strikeout, and then right here, a ball off the plate. It makes a good play. We'll flip it to Zubia. Texas with a Tuesday win. They win 4-1 over Sam Houston State, 9-0 on the season.